Good morning, Boker Tov. It's Tuesday. That means it's Torah Tuesday. How cool is that? And even cooler, the Los Angeles Dodgers won the division last night. Yay! Sorry about that, Braves fans. It was a great series. But somebody had to win, and quite honestly, I'm kind of glad it's us. Just saying. Okay. Let's get to some Torah. What do you think? This week, in this week's Parsha, it's Noah. We meet Noah and his family, and we're told the adventure of the flood. We've all heard the great adventure. God tells Noah to build the ark and bring his family and a pair of every animal onto the ark. Then God causes the great flood. It rains for 40 days and 40 nights. When the earth dries out, there is no life left except whoever's on Noah's ark. Then God tells Noah and his family to repopulate the earth and the animals to reproduce. So, why was Noah chosen for this task? What made him so really special? Noah, well, he's 600 years old and is a Zadik a wise and just man. The Parsha goes on to describe him as a man who walked with God. Walked with God? So what does that mean? The rabbis tell us that Noah was a respected and obedient man. He worked hard. He treated his family and others well. He could be trusted when the world around him was corrupt. The world had become so corrupt that God decided to cleanse the earth and start over. Noah was told to build the ark and who and what to bring with him. He didn't question. He just went to work. He obeyed. Hmm. Noah doesn't sound that brave to me, or he doesn't sound that wise. He followed orders. He obeyed. He never, ever asked why. I find a contradiction here. A Zadik doesn't just blindly follow. Does he really? Would a Zadik just go along with discrimination? Does a Zadik let the government declare war at will? Shouldn't he question? A Zadik is a wise and just man. Okay, so what was Noah thinking? How many people died in the flood? How many animals died? The Parsha doesn't say that Noah was the only good man, only that he was a good man. God gave us the ability to think, to reason. He gave us free will. Yet, Noah just blindly obeyed. Is this the actions of Zadik, a wise and just man? Think on it. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something. Like always, email me, comment, like. I love seeing your names pop up on the screen. Well, give me a holler. And until next week, I'll see you on Tuesday. Torah Tuesday.